<laughs> in terms of controversy, Ricky, you are not shy. Uh, you you do like. Well, I don't know if you like. Do you like getting into trouble? Do you like? I don't get into trouble. I'm, well, a, I'm a comedian. Fred West gets into trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Pedophiles with careers. What have I ever done? <laughs> no, but even, at the end, <laughs> even at the end of the Golden Globes, just in yeah. case you'd left anyone on a fed, did uh, how did you sign off? I just thanked everyone and I said, and of course, thanks to God for making me an atheist. <laughs> Which you can say here, but in yeah. America they take that stuff very seriously. Well, yeah, I think it's it's sort of. Um, I think it's about 10% atheist. I think here's about 45% atheist. But, um, yeah, they were offended by it. They thought it was... That's pretty... only because God lives in the Midwest, doesn't he? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's got a place there. Yeah. <laughs> was it the next day? Was it after the Golden Globes that you, someone sent you the picture of the church? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, I think some, some reverend somewhere or some bishop um, did a sermon for me to save my soul because I'm, I'm going to hell, of course. <laughs> this is a picture well. of the thing. It's yeah. a gen that's that's real. Oh, it's real. No, it's real. Yeah. yeah. A yeah. sermon for Ricky Gervais. Mm. <laughs> and then was it the same day or the next day that someone said that's you know, in LA? There's a difference. In New York, they named a sandwich after me. <laughs> <laughs> See in the window there, a sandwich for Ricky Gervais. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hell, but there's cheese and ham. <laughs> I suppose it's different, you are a comedian, da, da. but uh, as actors, I don't know, do you need to be more careful about what you say and do? Because, Johnny, I heard, it, 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 presumably because you're Johnny Depp, uh, like, I read a story about, was it because you were coming from Lima to Miami, I think, and you were stopped at customs? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, and if you hadn't been Johnny Depp, they probably wouldn't have stopped you, would they? Well, it's kind of an interesting route, anyway. Lima, Peru to Miami. <laughs> it does sound like a drug <laughs> rod. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> They're already expecting things, and uh, <clears throat> I did have some things. And, uh, yeah, there was a kind of a soft bag, and, and uh, the customs guy said, would you mind opening this up? And I said, he said, he said, first, he said, what is in there? I said, uh, stuffed piranhas. <laughs> I'm sorry, stuffed piranhas and some vampire bats. <laughs> Unzipped, and then there just happened to be some sort of vitamin powder that I was taking at the time. Yeah, I mean, in all seriousness. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, I'd still be in jail. <laughs> um, and they, it, when I unzipped it, poof, you know. <laughs> and there were these piranhas and bats covered in white powder. <laughs> <laughs> Why would these have piranhas and bats? <laughs> never, never mind the cocaine, <laughs> right? <laughs> Sorry, there. Yeah, yeah. um, well, why did you have piranhas and bats? Well, it was important to have them. <laughs> yeah, of course. Well, I had to bring them home. Yeah. But the guy thought he'd found the mother load, you know. He must have been so excited. Oh, God, it was... Oh. Ooh. After that, two-hander. He didn't go through with it, just so you know. All right. <laughs> no, so was... what did you, how did you say... Did I'm you still a virgin. This... Oh, I was a virgin until Ricky... <laughs> <laughs> did you say... Do you say, that's vitamin powder, don't worry about it, and he believed you? Is that, is that real? Do they he really do that? He did not believe me, no. No, right. So no, what do they no. do? Get... Everybody came out with guns and things like that. And you wow. put <laughs> that. But did you put a knife in your and go up the rigging? <laughs> to get away from you? <laughs> That's what I'd have done. <laughs> but did, you were trouble at customs there, didn't you? Oh, customs. I remember immigration in the states one time. I was going in and I panicked because the guy was like. Uh, so what, what do you do? And I goes, I'm, I'm a comedian. So he straight away goes, well, tell me a joke. And I just panicked. Cos I was like, if this joke isn't funny, he's not going to believe me and I can't get in. So it was like... <laughs> and I was like, oh, God. And then straight away I go, uh, what do you call an American? Oh, no, that's gonna, not going to work. <laughs> uh, you, and I just, like, if I say something, there's like, terrorism in her aunt like that is going to... And I just, I just panicked and I, uh, I came out with a joke that wasn't that funny. I goes, I goes uh, why do Morris dancers wear bells so the blind can be irritated by them as well? <laughs> 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 He doesn't know what a Morris dancer is. <laughs> so, <laughs> but he just he came back with what was basically the worst heckle I've ever had in my career, where he just went, I'm going to put actor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, uh, before we go tonight, let's have a story or two in the red chair. So, uh, who's up first? Hello, sir. Hello. Hi, what's your name? Mohammed. OK, and what do you do, Mohammed? Uh, I'm, re I'm a student. A student of? Radiography. Radiography. Yeah. A proper job. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'll well, when I was seven years old, I went on a holiday with my mother to Egypt. And um, during my time there, I saw a donkey that was fully erect. <laughs> <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs>
Okay, Sorry, Mahmoud, 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 Mahmoud. Do you mean do you mean he was standing up? <laughs> <laughs> I don't so what's the tell us your best story? I saw a donkey with an erection. <laughs> okay, so so you were shocked, Mohammed. I was shocked, so I put my mum up and I was like, Mum, mum, like. what's this thing hanging out? And then she said it's a spare leg. <laughs> and then after that, I was like, what's it for? And then she replied, when donkeys are happy, they have five legs. And when they're sad, they only have four. <laughs> so a week after, I went back to school and my teacher asked us to, to draw a picture of anything recent that we found interesting. <laughs> I, 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 I drew two pictures of a donkey. One was happy and the other one was sad. <laughs> we love your story, Mohammed. You can go. Well done, sir. Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Hello. Hi. Uh, what, what's your name? Uh, my name's Brooke. Brooke, and what do you do? Um, I work in PR. Oh, yes. Very vague. <laughs> uh, off you go, Brooke, with your delightful tale. Okay. Um, I actually have a story about one of your guests. Uh-oh. <laughs> um, I was riding the tube home from work one day, and I saw someone who looked suspiciously like a celebrity that I happened to adore. And um, he was wearing a stocking cap and some sunglasses, and I noticed that he had a tattoo on his arm that said, Jack. And I thought, oh my goodness. And I leaned over and I said, excuse me, are you who I think you are? And he looked up at me and he said, why, yes, I'm uh, Brad Pitt. <laughs> Needless to say, it wasn't Brad Pitt, and um, I got a great photo with uh, Mr. Johnny Depp on the platform at Bank Station. Is that true? <laughs> no. <laughs> what, on the tube? Photo evidence is yeah, true. Was it on the tube? Yeah. Oh, I think you true. were, Mr. Depp, you were with a, a BBC journalist. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I, I think you might just have a picture with some man. <laughs> <laughs> or, bizarrely, a picture with Brad Pitt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Take a picture do now. now. Oh, do you want a picture now? <laughs> okay, run out here, run out, <laughs> quick, quick, quick. <laughs> if you're fine, you. That's very nice of you. Run! <laughs> run, Brooke, run! <laughs> oh, oh. It's really nice to see you again. <laughs> Breaking. Stand, to get, stand together and we'll take a screen grab of you. There you go. <laughs> and we'll get that to you. Thank All right. You. Well done, Brooke. Very good. <laughs> well done, everyone. And if you'd like to join us on the show and have a go in the red chair, you can contact us via our website at this address.